Welcome to the Judy's Talk Show. Today we are going to talk about one of the most controversial issues of Bogotá, public transportation. We had invited the three most popular candidates of the, to be, to the competition to be the mayor of Bogotá. Please welcome to Alvaro Miano, Catalina Plazas and Rafael. Public transportation has been for many years a problem that any government hasn't been able to solve. Citizens of Bogota are waiting for new proposals that can improve the infrastructure and the quality of the means of transportation. And the question is, what would you do if you were the mayor of Bogota? Good night. Uh, when I am the mayor of Bogota, I will use more buses. Uh, we monitor systems to solve security problems in all buses, in all stations. Uh, in addition, I um, will build some bridges to avoid the Transmillennium Pass to stop in the red lights and reduce time to displacement to that another place. Good evening. If I am here, I will change the transport system in Bogota, implementing the subway in the city because uh, the, the, the system brings the different, uh, different benefits for the city. For example, the first is a short time in each displacement. The organization with the traffic uh, is better. More employment for the lot of people, mobility will be better in Bogota. These reasons are passing in, in my proposal. Really, if the Bogotans elect me to be a mayor of Bogota, I will build a trolley system with 200 buses, eco friendly buses, to transportation a lot of people, all the Bogotans, uh, sure and, and fast. And it's a system of low cost, it's cheaper, the city won't have to invest a lot of money, the city won't have to increase the debt and the taxes will be lower for all the citizens. That is my proposal, no more. Catalina, do you agree with the things that Albert and Rafael said? I have to disagree with Albert because I think it's really expensive to build um, a large subway. I think the idea of Rafael uh, is better. I'm agree with Rafael because uh, to uh, build a trolley system and uh, reduce taxes and um, it's eco-friendly and cheaper for, for people. I will take this uh, idea to my idea to the Transmillennial system. I'm not sure I agree with Catalina because in this moment the Transmillennial is very bad because it's a chaos and the mobility is very bad and the cost for the idea is very expensive you want a lot of bridges in different avenues and it's very expensive for the city and for other candidates I afraid I don't agree because uh, your idea is beautiful but if, if life in the last century but in this moment it's not a it's not, it's not good idea Okay, and um, your idea is uh, obsolete. It's cheaper, but the uh, spend time for the people in the, the displacement is the same, but the problem is the same. I'm afraid I don't agree with Albert because I think the subway is too expensive for Bogota and it will increase the taxes and it will increase the debt of Bogota. I don't think it will it, it is the solution for the transportation system. And maybe the um, it's a good idea to lower the, the time that the people have to spend to go to uh, anywhere. But um, it's too expensive. That's the real problem. On the other hand, Transmillennium maybe it works. 
for Google Hotel right now. But Transmillennium, I'm not agreeing with, with continuing spending money to fixing the ways to Transmillennium. I think we have to change Transmillennium for other kind of system. And I think it's better uh, the Troy system. I guess you have to agree to disagree. We need to discuss this controversial issue in another occasion. Thank you.